Hi everyone, David here from davidtomeaudio.com and in this video, I wanna show you guys how to set up a sidechain within Reaper. So we're gonna do just a really simple setup uh, just so we can do it really quickly and you guys can see exactly how it works. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna create two tracks because you're gonna need two tracks. Uh, one is gonna be the track where we're gonna have our effects. So I'm just gonna put my effect on right now and it's gonna be this one. Okay, so that's just gonna be on our top track up here. And then this bottom track, I'm gonna route into this effect, okay? So what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna uh, transfer over two sound effects that I have here. These are spell sound effects. Uh, whoop. Let's move this up here. Okay, so let's have a listen to each of these so we know what we're listening to. That's that one, and that's to this one. Maybe without the effect on. There you go. So those are the two sound effects that uh, we're going to be using. All right, so let me pull up my mixer here, and then we'll get going. Okay, so here's the mixer. So what I'm going to do is, uh, so this is going to be uh, the signal here is the signal that we're going to route into the effect. So this one we don't want to have sent to the master because we don't actually want to hear it. And that's this sound effect right down here. So this effect we don't want to hear it because we're going to send it into um, this effect here, okay? So we're gonna already hear it whenever we play through here, and I'll show you guys that soon. But yeah, we don't wanna hear it playing on its own track. Okay, so now if I play it, you shouldn't hear it because I just clicked on do not send to master. So if I play it, you don't hear anything. So that's perfect, that's exactly what we want, okay? Next thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back into my mixer here, back into the routing, and I'm gonna send this over to the first magic spell sound, that's this one here. And then the trick here to do, um, to do sidechain is that instead of routing it to one and two, which is gonna be the track that your uh, audio is on, you want it to send it to a new channel. So I'm gonna send it here to three and four. Okay, so this is gonna send it to a new track, which basically is your first uh, effect plugin here. So now if I look in here, you can see here I have my inputs, which is one and two, and I have my two sidechains already put on three and four. So my sidechain is on three and four, and that's what we just sent this one here to. We sent this sound effect into three and four. So now if I play it, from the beginning, I'm gonna do, if I play on the left side here, this should be my top sound, which is exactly what it is. And if I play it on the right, it should be this bottom sound. And that's exactly how it is. So now we have uh, perfectly set up our uh, side chain and we're ready to use this plugin. All right, so that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys liked it and found it valuable. I'll leave a link in the description for a free sound pack uh, that I put together for you guys if you guys are interested in getting those sounds for free. And um, yeah, I think that's it for this video. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.